What's up everyone? It's your boy Jermaine back with another video. So this one we're just gonna ride around. I don't know what you call this neighborhood. This is kind of like the Battery Street area. This area is a freaking ghost town. Now if you come here on the weekends, this parking lot usually it's full with like tourists. And it's one of those parking lots where uh, it's not the best place to park if you get what I mean. But over here it's kind of like a ghost town. You got the news station right here, which will probably always be there because the news, they're never going anywhere. And there's like all these really weird deserted alleyways. You know, I'm going to keep it real. This part of town right here, it reminds me of, um, I spent a lot, lot of time traveling in Eastern Europe. And this is what San Francisco has kind of reminded me of of a lot of, some, like a, a bunch of different cities you would see in Eastern Europe where it's just, you know, buildings and they're just deserted and, you know, it's just for lease and stuff like that. It's kind of what it reminds me of. Since the whole work from home culture started, poor San Francisco, <laughs> you know, after the work from home thing started after, you know, the, the disease, it's like a lot of tech companies figured out, yo, we don't need to be in the city anymore. So we can just work from home. And then also, you know, it's all the other problems that the city have, you know, the, you know, the, the kind of the, some of the insane laws they pass to basically let people do whatever they want. It's kind of like a domino, domino effect. And I love this city, but this is what it, what it looks like now. I will say before the pandemic, this area here wasn't, um, it wasn't like crazy busy. I, probably all these parking spots would have been full on a normal day, but it wasn't like crazy busy here. Um, I know someone's gonna say, oh, you're not stopping at the stop sign, but there's no cars coming. So <laughs> as long as you like, you know, slowly go through it. Um, off to the left, there's like William, Williams and Sonoma and also Party Barn. It's one place I really don't like dropping off. Like it's not the, I don't know, it's, it's not, the, not the easiest drop off location. Over here, this is what, it's Samson Street if I'm not mistaken. This building on the right is uh, Levi, Levi Plaza. So there's a lot of different Levi um, offices in here. I think there's like, Dockers is over here. That's another Levi's brand. And I'm filming this on a Monday. I'm filming this at lunchtime. I got the apps on, but the apps are like really dead. <laughs> you know, there's not much going on with the apps. So, I'm just making a quick video real fast. Oh, this Starbucks is still here. kind of go through here this is the bay club of san francisco that's like a like a, i think it, there's tennis courts if i'm not mistaken there and then there's also probably a really fancy pool and then a nice a nice fat membership to to enter the place you know it, it's not like a 24-hour fitness at all and now we're on battery street or is this battery street yeah this is battery street and here we have it. It is uh, a quiet day. It was raining earlier. I'm sure glad the rain stopped. This, this is a park off to the right. I've never really seen like any normal people go to that park. It's always people that work here. And then this is like the Levi's Plaza area. <laughs> it's like a ghost town around here. <laughs> yeah, this is what it looks like. It's so quiet. Like, I feel like I have to whisper. <laughs> I mean, this used to be like a city, you know, with like traffic and cars honking the horns. But now the only thing I hear is like my motor on my electric bike because it has like 6,000 miles on it or something. And I usually use the throttle all the time. <laughs> Funny. 
This is my like second time going to come into here, so I'm pretty sure I'm like turning a lot of heads now. It's like, oh, what's that guy doing? You know, <laughs> I'm not doing anything. Wow, it looks like someone tried to break in that car right there. <laughs> oh well, I mean, <laughs> welcome to the city. That's why I don't have a car. <laughs> well, that's one reason I don't have a car. I remember working at this restaurant. This is like a really fancy restaurant. I don't know if it's still open. It looks like it's still open. I used to do valet parking back in the day. And we would go there every once in a while. I better like get out of this neighborhood. I don't want to like circle around too much. <laughs> but if anyone says anything, it's like, bro, I'm filming. Like, <laughs> what's up? And who's going to say anything, by the way? <laughs> Like, it's not like anyone's gonna come out and, and be like, what's up, you know? This is where those new bike lanes start down here. You know, this part of town kind of reminds me of a couple of different places. You know, it kind of reminds me of this little deserted part of Austin I've been to. It kind of reminds me of a little deserted neighborhood in Memphis that I've spent some time in. It's just really weird. Like, it's just really deserted. There's, of course, there's these new buildings that they built like two years ago. And I'm pretty sure at least, at least some of, um, at least some of the buildings are vacant, I mean, um, full. But I would imagine there's a lot of uh, vacancies there. Just because vacancies is like the thing now. You know, there's so many places that are just empty. I'll stop at this red light because I know people will comment and it down in the comments like, oh, you always run the red lights. But when there's no cars coming, uh, what do you do? Just wait like, like they do in Germany, <laughs> you know? <laughs> I'll just go up and take battery down. Cause I really don't like just waiting at lights around here, especially when there's no one else around. It's like, I don't want to get jacked, you know? Look at this guy on the bike. He, he knows how to do it. Alright, hopefully the crab babies don't cry, but I just made a left turn. Alright, these are these new bike lanes, which, these bike lanes are a joke, by the way. Like, I like the fact that they put the bike lanes, but will it be enforced? I don't think so. I don't think, I don't think it's going to be enforced at all, because nothing else is really enforced around here. I'm trying to um, wait a second so that car with the loud music can go by. So I, wanna, I don't want to have to edit that out of the video. And also the car is really, really loud. Okay, cool. Yeah, this is a really cool building right here. This building on the, this one here, 288 Pacific, which you enter on this side of the street, but Pacific is over here. It makes no sense. Oh, it looks like there's a parklet that they finally got rid of. Yes, I hate the parklets. I understand that there's a lot of like, you know, a lot of restaurants restaurants that like the parklets because you can get more tables. But I'm not a big fan of them. I think they're they're look they look really tacky. I mean, some of them look cool, but a lot of them just look really tacky. And you know, they they've been up for like you know since uh, like they've been up for like two years or three years or something. So now they're they're just been weathered and. I just look kind of used up, you know? Let's keep going. Looks like this bike lane is closed here. I mean, uh, closed, that's not gonna stop me or I'm gonna keep going. You gonna look? Thanks. <laughs> you know, so many times I'm like uh, riding the bike and I'm on a street just like this. And just like that woman like walked up, so many times people will just walk out in the street without even looking and it, it just kind of blows my mind <laughs> i'm like wow you you really didn't even look at all we're gonna kind of go down here and then we're just gonna take some random alleys and then i'm probably gonna wrap up the video because i didn't want to make one too long i want to get on samson because i haven't taken samson in a minute let's go back and get on samson here We'll take this out and get on Samson. Oh no, I have to wait now.
gosh. This Samson Street is so bumpy. <laughs> they haven't paved it yet. They've paved some parts of Samson. For the majority of Samson, they haven't paved it yet. So it looks like this. Oh wait, it looks like they haven't paved any of Samson. Yeah, this is a really rough street. This, it, this street used to be really busy, by the way, back in the day. It was so busy that they like uh, they put up signs farther down to like ban private cars, so it, it would be less busy. But I don't know if it was ever enforced because I remember them doing that back when I was still driving, and I haven't been driving in the city for no almost five years now. What is that? Someone left their backpack? <laughs> All the random stuff that you see on this on the street. Like what someone left their backpack there. I wonder if it, it gets stolen out of someone's car or something. Yeah, this is a street I hardly ever see cyclists on. Because I want to say this is one of like the worst streets in the city. I've never seen a street so banged out. What's up? Oh yeah, they paved this other block right over here, I think. It's not that bad. It's not as bumpy as the rest of Simpson. So now we are at California. And for all the crybabies, I'm just gonna go around, go down here and do a U-turn, just like so. And I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna make a right. Cause I know so many people complain about the lights, but come on, it's California street. I won't just blow it, you know? Technically I didn't run the light, I just did a U-turn and on bikes, there's no law that says you can't do a U-turn on a bike. So technically, I didn't, didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> yeah, so they added this sign, do not enter from you know, 7.30 to 8.30. Unless you're like a commercial truck, a bus, a taxi, or a bike or something. And I'm just gonna go through that one with the pedestrians. You know, every time I make these videos, I'm not going to talk about the lights. I'm just going to do my thing. But since I had so many comments from the last video talking about, oh, you, you, went, you did three traffic violations. <laughs> I just thought I would, uh, you know, talk about it more in this video for entertainment purposes. But anyway, I'm going to wrap this one up. If I uh, hang out here for too long, someone from this building is going to come run me off. So I'm just going to hang out here for a second and I'll see you all later. Like, comment, subscribe. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot for watching, and peace out, y'all.